Welcome back my friends, I'm Daily Fix and we continue where I left off last time. Now the um, <laughs> the Vulcans, uh, they just refuse to be in a coalition with me, so I'm thinking it's going to be uh, taking us a lot longer. Um, perhaps we can actually get a Ascension perk that would help us at some way or form let's take a quick look here star base capacity defensive building research speed monthly unity admin of cap no a uh, bit of lag there subject integration is never going to do us anything yeah no nah, that's annoying that really is annoying so augmented realities is what we're working on right now the debris contains a number of computer cores um Relatively unscattered from the destruction of the... Yeah, uns... Scatter... Unscate? I don't know how to pronounce this, I'm sorry. Uh, from the destruction of the enemy fleet. Engineering teams are able to quickly piece together that the fleet was being commanded by a group calling themselves the... The, the Canate. An apparent reference to the Khan Nuni sign of the late 20th century's Great Khanate. A group of genetically engineered human augmented was seeking uh, to acquire more embryos preserved from the eugenic wars to bolster their numbers before striking out to claim a world of their own. Uh, so crisis has been averted. Yay! Yay for us. Yay for us. We got some research done. We got no new torpedoes. Um, let's go with the fusion torpedoes. And apparently there is more research at min cap. Uh, naval capacity. Ooh. Yeah. No, we're going for the naval cap. Uh, we, we just need a flat out bonus to naval cap and that will probably get us more in range with the Vulcans. And our science ships. Yeah, you're going to do automatic exploration from now on. I can, I'm so happy that I have that option now. I'm so happy with that. So, the fleet is still here. We are increasing its numbers and we're going to be continuing to increase their numbers. Because that is quite important for us. We're building a, another station. We can build one more, so this is going to be the final one for a for a bit until we get that naval capacity, which is absolutely gorgeous, which is amazing, and I like it. Are you guys I still at war? You are at war. Uh, you're not doing anything. I don't think you actually can do a lot, considering you have one planet and he has a lot more. The Tellarites is doing fine. They're strong, so we can actually look at what they are doing against what we are doing. So their fleet is is more than twice the amount, uh, but the technology, we're getting close. We are getting close to that, a lot closer than our economy. Uh, but once all of these planets start producing, that's going to be absolutely great. So we have the onboard physician labs, or the physics labs, the bio labs, and the chemistry labs. Um... They will just produce engineering, society, and physics. So, very interesting. Uh, shield emitters. Optical computer. I quite like to go for the optical computer. Uh, system has been surveyed. Great. Anything else they want to do? No. We can also increase or upgrade all of these, uh, all of these ships. I actually want to do that right now. So, let's go. Uh, use well, upgrade. Go upgrade and do whatever. And we're going to keep a close eye on, on these fellas before... Oh, they're now at negative 12. Uh, that's because the trade deal is is going down. Um, Can we suck up to them? Like, there is nothing else in the world that we can do. Look, this is not as much, though, but it's 92... This is, this is. Mm, this is definitely not good for my economy. 
So the bait jaws. So I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait out for a bit more before we do that. So that's bait jaw. These guys are now going to be upgrading as well. Do you have to? Yeah, yeah. We we need to upgrade. We need to upgrade our ships. Let's do the automatic upgrade. Sorry, because I keep forgetting. And I know it's not the best of ideas. I'm very sorry for that. Uh, but if I don't do this, yeah, we're going to have a problem. Wait, what? Something did change. Oh, we are building a ship. That's why we can't do this. So, construction ship, although... There you go. New thrusters. Science ship. No changes. So, we did do the science ship, but we were just like, nah, we're not doing anything else. Which is fine. Who needs that? Let's see, that all looks okay. Once you are done. Yeah, look at that. that that's just a flat out boost to almost everything. I like that. Prime Minister has developed a new skill. Uh, more unity. Oh, look at that. We are done through our research. Uh, let's go to Hull. And... Hmm... Let's go with the face cannons. We need flat out damage. And uh, let's get the leader experience gain. And... Ooh, no. Thank you. <laughs> that would be... That would be horrible. So, my... My current admiral can only go for a hundred. So there's there's a few options that we have. We could let's go from this. We can't take this one. Mm. Let's see. We don't have subjects, so that this will never do. Uh, edict duration is longer. Administrative cap is just not going to work out for us. We are already. Uh, we're not. We're still in. We're still in, but it's barely there. Uh, monthly unity is uh, quite nice. The research speed, star bases, defensive platform, star base capacity. It will probably help our, with our fleet. Uh, star base hull, influence. Okay, now call me an idiot, but I'm thinking we need to get opinion up by 20. Okay, before we do this, let's let's do a save. Let's do a save. Let's do a save. Let's uh, let's say episode eleven, because that's basically what's going. This is going to be it, right? Um, I want to see what it does. So it is their opinion of us, which is just going down. What we'll do there because we don't have a trade deal with the Andorians, right? Uh, the pajam exposure is almost there. We're at negative twenty-one. So let's take a quick look. We're going to be taking this and see whatever it is that it is doing. So that has been negative uh, 19. As for you, negative 10. Mm, so it is barely doing anything. It is just a... Yeah, it's just plus 20 in relations. Yeah. We don't want to revoke that... They're at war, so we can't do anything else. Rule of acquisition number 34. War is good for business. Yeah, I sure think you're right. War is good for business. Um, might be good for initial contact, but for now, I don't think that that is um, the wisest of decisions. So, we're going back. And we're going to get the fleet capacity... Because we uh, otherwise need another admiral. And why wh 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 were you going backwards? Stop going backwards. You need to go for 100%. Not, not falling back. It's not how it works, game. Okay? So with you, we're going to take the fleet command limit. For now. And the next stop is going to be this one. Diplomatic influence costs negative 50. Which will burst our influence Quite a bit. By the looks of things, we have a few commercial packs and some research agreements. And being into this federation is costing us 1.5. That will go down by 50%. Which is nice. But now we can actually boost our fleet. Now, this station, how far along are you? Can we get... No, we need to wait for this one to return. 
the okay that's great just just give me all of those invitations i'd rather have people like me than hate me we might form a federation with others <laughs> um, i don't know i don't know i still say we might be on a uh, a bit of a problem area so we know that boosting this will so 20 will give this a negative two. Oh, that's not good Ah, oh, this trade deal is going to kill me I kind of want to do it again let's 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 test this out let's test this out you can when you guys you don't like me just doing trade deals left right and center and they're, they're just not doing anything right please say you are um so negative 12. And let's do minerals, because we could spare the most of that. Let's do 10. And we'll do two alloys. 30 years. Infinite diversity in infinite combination. Come on, negative 12. Holy crap, do you see that? It is just gone down by two. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would have destroyed me. I would have been so mad. I would have been so, so mad at myself if I didn't save. I would have gone instantly. Look at that smiley. Just, just, this must be... Is, is this actual... Is this this on the ship? I've never seen that. Uh, it might be. There was a bit of a yellow spot over there. So, just doing that trade deals with the Vulcans is just not doing anything. So, the ship has now been built, right? Survey complete. Why can I not? This is so weird. I can't even change the name, do you see that? Randomize the name. We could probably do like space. This is just stupid. We can actually change the things ourselves, which will be okay. Let's go with the the photon torpedoes. It's even more shield damage though. Actually, no. Let's get you out. We might even have to do this manually. Okay, you. Okay, we still can't save this. Already exists for another ship design. Where? Why is this? Let me just save it. I will change the name then. Whatever. It's fine. Optical computer. Get shields. Trust us. Science. Anything over here? No, these are fine. Can't save this. So, let's do the space, whatever. Uh, we'll change the designs. Let's let's get rid of you and go away. Can I now auto this? Yes, I can. That's great. Fleet. Let us change you into that. That will definitely work out for you. We're going to ninety four. 9449. Let's wait until the station is done. And uh, we need to upgrade all of these. And that's a whoop. That's that's expensive. That is expensive. 496. It will probably change our relative power at the moment. Oh wow, that's definitely a uh, a change there. 501. Let's speed up a bit more. Uh there's face cannons that will um we'll have to do everything again. Tractor beams or shield ray emitters. Let's do the shield ray emitters. That means that we have to upgrade all of the ships again. Uh, Tyrium hull. Upgrading again. Um, let's go with the districts. Live long and prosper. Still negative 12. I will go with the Endorians if I have to. And I will beat the living crap out of the Vulcans if they don't start to behave. <laughs> like that's ever going to happen right yes i know i know 
Yeah, we're currently just a living joke. Okay, so you have to upgrade again. Ships upgraded. That means you can go on your way. So let's wait. It they definitely they gave us a good boost. Uh, they're still overwhelming. They will challenge you. Which is... Um, okay, so let's see in terms of relative power. Yeah, we need more. Let's do... No upgrades are available, so go ahead, automatic explore. And we can upgrade our construction ships as well. Let's let's just upgrade everything. And we are still awaiting some ships to be upgraded. It's is it an alloy thing at the moment? Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. Hmm. Okay, that's good, I guess. Relic available, we don't care. Okay, with you done, we are in desperate need for more alloys. The 250, let's zoom out because I double click all the times and that's not what I should be doing. Let us make sure that you get done what is this um coalition offers of course they are starting to form coalitions which could be bad which could be bad uh diplomatic incident oh no ah <sighs> okay oh it's bajorans okay a series of ill-timed and offensive I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> I hope you didn't hear that. Uh, offensive leaked communications from the um, Bejoran Second Republic. A diplomat a diplomatic presence on Earth has been resulted in a substantial de uh, deterioration of the relations between our two governments. Oh well. You get rid of that. Ships yeah, that's not true. We're going to be upgrading you again. And look at that. It's again... 226. Now we boosted about 200. Um, what are we doing? The Ferengi? No. Nope. If it is real, it is important. Okay, that actually changed. Plus one. Did you see that? So that's a good sign. How about this? We can actually invite them into a coalition. going to bite me in the ass so badly okay naval cap plus 40 trust grove there we go trust grove plus 10 percent this is what we need we need that trust grove and we're not going to do the endorians before getting the um the vulcans a uh, traffic control production let's go with the production we got plenty of them so yes we can get the endorians and i'm aware of that but um, they're not being liked by the, um, the Vulcans at the moment. If they Infinite just didn't rival each other... Infinite combination. Then that would have been great. But we need to be climbing in relative power. There's 774. This definitely helped us. And we can go up to 185... We should actually get an Annex class ship in here. So, let's do 6, 3... Let's do 8, 4, 2. I, I like these, these numbers, just having more than, of one of than the other. Just so the sense of accomplishment, I guess. Let's do 5. We can't do more, though. We can do 3. How much further can we go? Like three ships and then something like this. This could probably work. It's 105 and we are up to 108. Of our 85. Uh, we still have to build the naval depot thing over there. Hmm. Let's get rid of you. Like this. 
It's going to be expensive, but this will definitely boost the power the most. It's more than... Wow, that's a lot of alloys, though. But I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. This this will definitely get my power projection up quite a bit. Um, food is good. We could actually use some... Energy. And we need to get Unity going on all of the planets because it's been... Uh, it's been neglected quite a bit. So we're getting close. We can actually go and do the coalition with the Andorians. Live long and prosper. Uh, but the acceptance of the uh, the Vulcans. Why? Why? Why is this? Let's take a quick look. Let's... Because they are now superior and friendly. They're no longer protective. And that's the problem with real, them. They are protective and overwhelming. Getting fleet power will get the Vulcans on board. Yeah, that's great. Go away. Uh, so that's going to be it, guys. We are getting close. I can feel it. We're, we're getting close to forming the coalitions we need to form the Federation. So I'm happy about that. I, I truly am. I really am happy about that. So let's save up on alloys. And next time, I would like to boost my fleet more. Now remember, this is Grand Admiral. This has no scaling. Meaning all of the other empires are automatically stronger as we are. That we are able to get to this level, I think is going to be a wonderful achievement. Now just, just to uh, boost myself out of my... Just a little bit of a, uh, a confidence boost for me. It would have been quite nice, if you may say so. <laughs> Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Goodbye.